Hey everybody, welcome to my live. Um, Aaron, your foot is so in the cook zone. Better? So much better. Okay, um, yeah, drywall dust on his foot. That's what that was. Okay, gross, but we're live. And we're gonna do our bathroom etiquette transfer, which the reason why we're doing, I'm doing that one now, this weekend I'm gonna show you some really awesome transfers that have not been available until this Monday. So on Monday, this will come live, um, 11 o'clock a.m. Eastern time, I believe, uh, 9 a.m. Mountain time. So I wanna show you this, and then I'll show you my fun project that I'm doing with it. I have been waiting for this since Chalk Tour came out. I have, because I have had bathroom decor in my old house and I have not done anything in my new house. So let me show you what we've got going here. See all of this? The relax, comb your hair, brush your teeth, wash your hands, and then the images. So what we're gonna do um, is really cool. Hang on just a second. <gasps> there I am. You can see me, you can see the project. Awesome. So this is what we're gonna do. I need to kind of cut these apart first and mark the backs because that's what you're gonna do as well. And I wanna teach you the right way. I love this tub. I wish that I had the tub like this. Someday my husband will grant me my wish. I will get a nice big soaker tub because I do not have one and I want one. It would be nice to have today. Or a hot tub on the deck, that would work too. I am totally, hi Jana, hi Robin, hi Susanna. Howdy, howdy ladies. Make sure you're saying hi when you come in because um, if you're not my friend, I don't actually see you come in. I can only see people who are on my friends list, right? Did you guys know that? Makes it hard for me to, to welcome you, but it's all right. Susanna, did you get your stuff from this afternoon? Yes, no, I'm almost done cutting. One more. All right, so we have that done. Let me get this a little bit. Hi, Amy. Welcome. All right, so what we're going to do is I bought some matching frames. So I have these black matching frames, and they're just 8 by 10s What we're going to do is we're just going to take the back off of each one and take the paper out. Oh, 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 that's like nails on a chalkboard. I cannot handle it. The squeaky paper um, makes me crazy. I cannot stand squeaky paper. Okay, take that off. Then I have this great lint-free. I'm just gonna wipe it on the inside. Place, this is just a sheet of white construction. No, I do not use construction paper. It's cardstock. This is white cardstock going in. Cut to fit eight by 10. And don't mistakenly do anything else like I did. I ruined a piece already. I've been out of the cardstock cutting business for a while now. And then pop these back down into place. That should be good. And then you have a really cool uh, frame with a whiteboard. So we've got a whiteboard and a black frame. And then what I'm gonna do is, we're gonna do the words. So this will be, gotta match them. All right, so my tub picture and then the words picture will go underneath and this will be Fabulous. It better fit. 
thought for sure this was this would be eight by ten it would totally fit I think it will so because this is glass we're gonna chalk right on top of the glass and we're going to fuzz our transfers so um, let me do that I will right back on it and then get these fuzzed We'll do one at a time. I know they had bigger frames, but I thought for sure that the eight by 10 would be okay. So we will see. If it's not, I will. I really think that's the widest one. So I will improvise if I had to. Okay. Done labeling, set those aside, move that. Let's get our bathtub on here. Anybody having, doing anything special this weekend? Any fun plans? Clearly I'm going to be chalking. Still a little shopping today. If you are, see my profile, you'll see that I did some shopping today. Glass is just really, really... Oh, hi, Emma. Are you dancing in the background? Yeah. Emma's in the background dancing. Come say hi. Who, me? Yeah, you. Susanna's watching. Suzu. Oh, Cassie's here too. <laughs> yes, Cassie's here too. So let's get this on. Free advertising. Free advertising. Oh, Schlotskis, you got to get down. Get down on it. Get down on it. Um. Ooh, that's gonna run into. Okay, I need to move, like I need to move it over a fraction of a centimeter. Hi, Kelly. Hi, Patricia. Hi, Annette. Hi, Amanda. I am. Tr this is gonna fit just perfectly, and I need. Why are we running in the background now? I'm so confused. Okay, there we go. All right, I got that on. And then this will go at the bottom. It'll be much easier to do. I'll go ahead and do both of them. I think we can just layer both. My tan, oh girl, I know. I love the sun, I can't help it. If I have a pool, I love to be outside. Of course, I wasn't at the pool today. Actually, I wasn't at the pool all week. We had busy, busy, a very busy week. So, if you guys break anything over there, I tell you what, it's coming out of your paycheck. I like how they all have like, there's a little dent at the bottom. Yeah. Are those on purpose? Yes. That's nice. Isn't it fun? They're looking at my Ray Dunn. Okay, now we're gonna do this in black. Art in the Park in Plymouth. Well, I do have plans tomorrow. Tomorrow is, um, what are we doing tomorrow, Aaron? We are going, Aaron's getting drywall, more drywall. Then we're going to uh, he's going to go golfing, and then, <gasps> I have no water spray bottles, Aaron. I don't know what to do. I'm um, just like right there. Emma will do it because Emma loves me enough. Okay, well, I didn't know what she needed. <laughs> A water spray bottle. Um, Got to stir up my black. There we go. It 
looked pretty thick, but I've got it all. What are you guys doing over there? Us? Yeah. We're reading cups. Admiring my cups and my yeah. my canisters. Yeah. Okay. Whew. So I'm going to leave that right there. I'm going to grab my new squeegee and we're going to dip and go, guys. Make sure you're saying hi to me. I need to see who is watching. Um, we'll just start up here and we'll go around. Well, you right. need to exit now. I can't believe you just did it. No, it was You had your foot on it and you pushed down. Yep, you need to go. Upstairs. Children. Mom's working. Oh, serious. She just started. She just started. You can talk to her when she's done. That's funny. They just did, um, they just popped my bubble wrap. Can't have that. So after this is done, it's going to look amazing. I have high hopes anyway. I love how the black turns out on glass for the most part. I say that and hopefully I won't have any problems at all. There we go. Put the rest back in my little canister. Still working on a two ounce one here. It's gonna be done soon, and then I'll whip into a three ounce. Let's peel both of them off. Ooh, I need an extra hand. Somebody, anybody, do I have somebody? Give me a hand. Hi, Hope. I need you to hold down. Thank you. That way I can carefully peel my tub transfer. Why is it so sticky? Well, I fuzzed it, but I could have probably fuzzed it some more, I guess. Hold on. This needs to go in water. Watch your toes. Watch your toes. There's a tub right here. You're funny. <laughs> ah, ha, ha, ha. Not really. You gotta clean my fingerprints off this because I don't want anybody to lift them on their camera and All right, get into my iPhone. <gasps> you guys, look at that. My tub is crooked. Urgh. You don't wanna lift? I must have installed it. Yeah, oh my gosh. Is it really? Okay, so let me look. Doesn't look like it doesn't either. look like it. I think it was just the way I was. I had my thing. It's not crooked. Okay, so this is what we're doing. Image and then the words on the black and white and do black and white. I see now that I could have had bigger frames, but <sighs> yeah, uh, this is um, the biggest one. And so the other one's probably will be a little bit easier to handle. So let's set that one aside. Actually, let's put it over here. The next one, make sure and then wipe. Ah, my board cleaner. Wipe this off with my lint-free thing. Let's do brush your teeth and I'm going to fuzz this more than I fuzz the other one. You know what I need? I need this one. This is a way fuzzier. Some of the cloths are fuzzier than others. You need to lock your, I don't even have a lock on my basement door. I'm telling you what, this is what I want, Jana. I want a light at the top, at the door that says live. Or like on air. on air. I want an on air sign. So then when I am on air, everyone is quiet and 
like well behaved. That's what I want. Sure. Thank you, Cassie, for thinking of well on air. Okay, brush your teeth. I need this one in every bathroom. Well, I need it in my children's bathroom the most. But these are going into our downstairs like powder room. Okay, so fuzzed means I'm sticking my transfer to the washcloth to make it less sticky. Why would I do that? Because glass is a, a non-porous surface. Hi, Lori. And if we're using a non-porous surface, this stuff will stick to it and you won't be able to peel it off. It will get stuck. You'll peel it so hard that it will stretch it out and it's, it's no good. So you have to fuzz your transfer when you're working with a non-porous surface. Now, if you're working with like a plastic or a coated surface or fabric or anything like that, you don't have to. So many of the things that you've worked with, Jana, you haven't needed to. Oh, look at this. Um, so yeah, so that's what fuzzed means. And Chalk Couture, on the back of your transfers, they have the directions of how to use all the products. And it will tell you to fuzz it. It'll tell you every time, but I, I know that you don't need to every time. Just because of the experience of using the products and knowing, right? Yeah. They ask a question and then I answer it myself. Okay. Let's see if this will pull off easier than the last one because I fuzzed it with a better cloth that was more fuzzy. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I need my Emma. She's my cleaning, she's my transfer cleaning girl. Ooh, it looks nice. Hold on. Putting it in the water. I'm just going to um, try to get some of this off right now. If my husband loved me, he would do it for me. Do what? Use your hands and um, wash my transfers in the water, but leave them in there. That's what I do. Normally, when I'm not having construction in my basement, my water is right next to me, and so I can do that real quick. So, brush your teeth. Fun. Probably could have put the tooth, could have put, have put it up a little bit more, but it's good. Let's move that over here. I feel like I need music. Do I need music? No, I got the ball game. Dr. W needs that brush your teeth in his office. Who's Dr. W? Hi, Gerilyn. It is a cool tool. This is our new uh, multi-purpose tool. Okay. Now we're going to do wash your hands, which my son... Oh, this is going to be touchy. This is a tall... Oh, good gravy. It's a tall one. I'll have to do them separately. Wash your hands... For Easton he comes out of the bathroom I'm like go wash your hands he's like how did you know I'm like because I didn't hear any water running and he's like oh. and then he'll go in and he'll be like I need privacy and he'll shut the door and then he'll come out and I'll be like go back and wash your hands and he's like oh, how did you know I'm like dude you can't fake me out all right so I'm putting this one up high and I'm eyeballing it because that's my mood today. If I regret it, then I regret it. Swipe it up and there we go. Right. That's That's a great thing about chocolate too. Did you hear him? Say it again. If you make a mistake, you can just wipe it up and do it again. 
You act like you know what you're talking about. I've seen a few of these. But you haven't done any. Nope, I haven't. You should. Jake is about to take date, but he's oh. stuck your cords. He's fine. Jake's fine. Kelly He'll get out of know it. What they, they means. No. Aaron thought he was gonna pull something. My phone cord is under my desk and Jake always likes to come down and get under the tables and lay down. Oh, these new squeegees are the bomb. Dot com. Okay. I am so used to using the three ounce containers, like I just wanna be done with my two ounce ones. Ta-da! All right, now I gotta do the, oh, thank you. Don't. Don't um. Don't fold it on itself. Don't fold it on itself. I know better than that. Gosh, and that says hi. These frames are just like cheaper little frames. They're kind of plasticky from HL. 50% off, you know. I want to dry this because. I have to do the wash your hands over it. Okay, so that's dry. Make sure it's cooled off. And then this needs to get fuzzed. So we've got this one, and then we'll do one more with the brush or comb your hair. Where'd my, oh, here it is. Ha ha. Yeah, um, this towel is super fuzzy and very soft, and it's better at fuzzing than this one, which has a tighter nap or something. It's just not as fuzzy. So get the Country Living Style That Lasts for your fuzzing towel. From High Pile. High Pile. Actually, I found those super cute at, um, what's that place called in Battle Creek? Ollie. Ollie's. I got it at Ollie's for so cheap. They have like the nicest, cheapest towels um, that you don't mind. They're cute, they're nice, they're soft, and you don't mind having them in your craft room. Or garage. Uh, why would you have them in our garage? Uh, for oil. Not my Ollie's towels. <laughs> Are you missing any? Great, yes, he's a great helper. Two hours in the, oh, in your craft room? Or Ollie's? You don't go to Wattis anymore? Oh, yes I do. Yes I do. Oh, you're right. I should have. Uh, yeah, I, I just didn't know what you were saying, Susanna. We still go there. Good old Dr. Wattis. I forgot. The boys' appointments are coming up, too. I just saw it on my calendar. I hate the dentist. Like, I don't ever want to go, but I have to. It makes me, like, have anxiety. I don't like people touching my gums, my mouth. Oh, jeez. You drew me a picture while you were at work? Oh, just now. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Cassie, do you want me to pay? Yeah, let me see. Um, it's of you. I do too. So, Nicole, this is a brand new... Here, Gruber. Is this is going to stain me? It's not going to stain you. It's chalk. Oh, I cute. Know, I just <gasps> it's Creative Sarah. Oh, Cassie drew a picture of me. Let's look at it. Creative Sarah, mom, friend, idol, teacher. Hi, guys. Welcome to my live. Yes, that's what I say. I Chalk it up. Creative Sarah, welcome to my live, guys. 2.0. She's funny. <laughs> oh, two hours in Hobby Lobby. Yeah, yeah. HL. So, Nicole, here's the thing. This is the only transfer I have because it's only, it doesn't become available until Monday morning. And so I can't let anyone use it before I use it because I get to use it for my live and then I put it out on my rack for customers to use. So you're gonna need this Monday morning. 
I'm gonna do the last one and then we'll put them all together and see what they look like. I'm telling you, for a year I've been waiting for a bathroom transfer. A year. <sighs> Not as long as you've been waiting for the bathroom down here. <laughs> and I'm so waiting for a bathroom in my basement. Seven years on that. I do have a sink down here that when I started this business, my husband put in for me, so that's good. Yeah, well, if you would have said his name, Susanna, I would have known what you were talking about. But because um, you said W, I was like, I don't get it. And I wasn't, I wasn't even thinking. I wasn't thinking. Well, be careful. And try to use your hands to um, like get this. Get just the, like this? Go try around. to use your hands to get the fuzz off of the back. Oh, I just did that. I'd like to focus on the front. Okay. You can use it next time. But it's really curvy. Um, the new tool and the new squeegee are a must. The new squeegee makes me so happy whenever I use it. No, because you guys know that my favorite is always the um, angled squeegee, which I have. They're all over. Um, but I didn't even run to it this time because I had my, this one. The orange peeler? No, the orange peeler is the multi-purpose tool, Erin. Get used to that. Learn the name. Jeez Louise. Okay, let's make sure. This didn't feel like it was sticking down very much, so I wanna make sure, because that would stink to like get to the last one and then have all the errors happen on this one. Yeah, so one, okay, so this new tool, let me tell you about it. Um, besides stirring up your chalk, you, this also is a scraper for the inside of your container, okay? It can really get around the edges with this. And then it is a mini, mini um, squeegee where you can like do little intricate things and you can hold it like a pen and so you actually feel like you have far more control and, and it's it's nice because it's thick and sturdy. So I love it. They came out with it just, you know, and I got to play with it at conventions. Awesome. I did not get to bring some home with me. Oh, wait, maybe I did. What? Did I get to bring a multi-purpose tool home with me from convention? Uh, it was in your shipment, I thought, or whatever. Well, a shipment is different than bringing it home. I don't remember if you brought it home or not. But I, I can't remember. Okay. Oh, the bathtub. That's because it was so sticky. That's what happens. I can flatten it out later, but you can leave it in there. All right, we got to peel and reveal now. He's so inappropriate. Here's another one. Oh, oh, oh. Here's another one. Okay, you guys, oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Um, throw these in there. Actually, just take that. I'll take this. Because I want to scrape this and like get it all back in to the container. Clean it up a bit. I'm probably only gonna use this a couple more times. And then, all right, here you go. And I gotta clean that off. Some containers just get so goopy. You gotta clean off the edge so that it seals nicely and doesn't dry up on you. You do not want your chalk paste drying up. You do not want your chalk paste drying out. Tammy, I know. Hi, Michonne. 
Howdy, howdy. Okay, so I am going to make way for all of these fun things that I made tonight. So you guys can kind of see. So if you want to replicate um, the bathtub was the biggest one. It does fit, but I feel like it's kind of squished. There is room on the edge, but um, so these will go on in um, on my walls in my bathroom. And so just a frame, white card sock in the back, and then I chalked on top of the glass. Fuzz, fuzz, fuzz your transfers while like before you chalk on them. I cannot stress stress it enough that glass can just suck right onto your transfer and it'll hold it forever. Do you think they'll do another Rocktober promo like last year? I think they're gonna do some promos getting into um, the fall. I think this first year was really weird. They've done a lot of designer promos, things for us and not so much for um, customers yet. That's why I do my own. So if you watch me, I have my own sales in my group, my VIP group. Um, Aaron needs a wash your mouth with soap sign. <gasps> I could make one. I could do it right here. Are you wash me your, mouth your, and then instead of hands do mouth with soap and just use my letters. I'm That's not going to be on these lives very much if all I'm going to do is sit here and take abuse. It's not abuse. It's, she said you need that sign. Why? Oh, because he has inappropriate sayings. Who is this? I'm Cindy, hi. So, um, yes, my picture in picture is through Switcher. Um, yeah. Sounds like a Michael Jackson video. Switcher. Are you trying to sing Thriller with the word switcher? That's a new one. Okay, so we did it all. Monday, this is available. The It's called Bathroom Etiquette. And very simple, simply beautiful. Plain and simple, but they're going to look awesome. When I get them hung up, I will take pictures and show you. Um, my bathroom, my powder room is a little small, but you'll get the picture when Aaron hangs it up. Cause let's be honest. I don't know what's fuzz and what's not fuzz. Um, fuzz is like lint that's no, I'm wet. Just saying, I don't know which ones I've done, which ones I haven't. Oh, okay. I had a system, but then you had more. Than All right. So thanks for watching. I am hoping to get on tomorrow and Sunday as well with two new transfers that are also coming out on Monday that you have not seen from me yet. So that should be fun. So keep an eye out. Did you all get to see my lemonade one from from Thursday? When did it I do it? It was super cute. Wasn't it? Because all four of my kids were there Wednesday. Or no, it was Thursday morning they needed to sell Thursday. That would be Thursday. No, it was Wednesday. It was Wednesday. It was Wednesday and I didn't do it live on my page. I did it live on my profile, but I shared it to my page so you wouldn't have got notifications. So you should go check it out. It was hilarious. From July. Though. Well, hilarious if your kid misbehaving is hilarious. Um, I thought it would be a great family thing to make lemonade. Well, they're doing the lemonade stand and then I went, I'm like, let's make a sign and go live. And anyway, <gasps> thank you. Thank you. All right, guys, have a great weekend and I will see you later. Adios. Thanks, Tammy.